Shalom Kharim, I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. And friends, we have been trying to take steps to prepare for the things that are happening here in the United States. Very, very alarming, uh, those things that are happening. Uh, we went ahead and did the new live stream. And we didn't get enough support to be able to cover the cost completely. Uh, but we took the steps because we feel like it is that important to do so. Uh, it, on our live stream account, we are already Israeli News Live, and now we actually have the URL uh, livestream.com forward slash Israeli News Live. And you will be able to watch on there. I think our old broadcasts were removed because uh, we were trying to save money with live stream a little while back, so we discontinued it when we were only on YouTube. But our account was still active uh, as a free account. We have now uploaded that, uh, brought it back. I'm about to do a broadcast here live in about the next probably 10 minutes by the time this video here loads. Uh, on live stream, I am going to discuss the issues that YouTube would ban my channel for. So if you want to know the truth about things, that's going to happen on live stream. We want to keep this channel up and alive on YouTube, but I realize there are controversial subjects that we are not allowed to speak about on YouTube without being totally shut down, if they don't shut it down altogether. And there are some very troubling things that we have been dealing with and more and more, these things are coming to light. Uh, I shared with you briefly not long ago that Israeli News Live has been infiltrated, not successfully, but on multiple occasions. And to some degree, the first att initial attempts were successful because of our trust for people that they were honest and good and true believers. But Jesuits, are very sly. And we have seen this infiltration uh, or the attempted infiltrations on every level. And not only infiltrations, but we also have been dealing with uh, a conspiracy and behind the scenes to try to delegitimize the news content that Israeli News Live produces. Why? Because we're not biased. Regardless of what the truth is, we always try to be honest. As Americans, as believers of Yeshua, but yet, I say Jewish, my mother was from uh, the descendants of the house of Judah, my father is from the descendants of the house of Israel. Uh, so I'm really more of an Israelite than a Jew, per se. And as a re regarding that, Israeli News Live, has become a very well-known channel, especially amongst the evangelical community. And there is a major concern for the Zionist movement. Now, that's not those that love Israel. That has nothing to do with the Jewish people that have returned to their homeland as prophesied by the Word of God. That is the Illuminati Jesuits that are trying to overtake the Jewish people and subvert them under a totalitarian regime that the Vatican will end up having control over in the near future. And there is a lot in American political circles as well that are those type of Zionists, part of the Rothschild movement, which, by the way, Rothschilds and Jesuits work hand in hand. You want to talk about those that say they are Jews and are not? There are, that's your Jews that claim to be Jews and are really are not Jews. So we are dealing with every avenue you can think about. We have channels out there that are uh, really pushing the narrative for the evangelical and the messianic community that are trying to delegitimize Israeli news live because we're willing to tell you the truth and they want to keep you on track for an agenda. We are being uh, subverted by those that have gotten close to us, learn some of the in-depth revelations that the Lord has given me that would help the Jewish people to recognize the Messiah that have now infiltrated inside the Israeli community and Israel, posing themselves to be now Orthodox Jews and trying to instruct the Jewish community some of the very in-depth teachings that I've done, saying that that 
is not, Yeshua is not the Messiah. They want to totally undermine the New Testament so that when the time comes, Rome will be able to present whatever type of Antichrist they want and the Jews will accept that instead of believing that Yeshua was actually that Antichrist. And Rome is involved in this agenda as well. So I have to be very careful what I say and what I do here on YouTube. I encourage you, go to live stream, look up Israeli News Live, or I'll have the link below, livestream.com forward slash Israeli News Live. Subscribe there. That is our backup place. I am told that this will also air on Roku television if you go to Roku and you look up Israeli News Live. Now, maybe it takes 24 hours. I have no idea. Um, but you guys, I'm sure, can at least let me know in the comments, have you been able to see this on Roku TV? Uh, we will be airing, though, here very shortly live. So go check it out. Get subscribed. Get joined up. And as soon as we get to Europe, I'm going to tell you what really happened is some of these uh, shootings in America. Can't tell you here on YouTube. They'll only shut it down. I'm Stephen Benoon with Israeli News Live. Shalom.